Hi, I'm Jennifer Duby Works. I am the development director for Museum LA, and Jonathan and the Androscoggin Land Trust invited us out this morning for an amazing kayak along the Androscoggin River. Well, I'm Lincoln Jeffers. I'm with the City of Lewis's Development Department. We're on the river this morning, and uh, just loving being out here first thing in the morning uh, with the sunrise, waiting for the balloons to come up. Uh, we paddled. Uh, Upriver from the little Androscoggin, sitting at the base of the Cowan Mill, looking at the remnants of uh, that old vintage building. And first time I've actually seen the base that's usually underwater. Very cool infrastructure. Uh, it's great we had so many people turn out for a paddle, and uh, probably, I don't know, 20, 25 people out here this morning enjoying the river. All right, uh, Jonathan Labonte with the Androscoggin Land Trust. We're out here at the base of the Great Falls, waiting for some balloons to go up. This is the first meeting of the Great Falls Paddling Society. Uh, Saturday morning, we made an attempt last night, only to be interrupted by some pretty brisk thunderstorms. But uh, we've got 20 boats out here this morning. Weather couldn't be better. I'm hearing good news. The balloons are uh, getting ready to launch. So. Also, I figured I'd come look at it from a different view. So I started the first five years working it, and now it's good to relax and watch it from here. It's the best view other than being up there. So. so my husband and I, we bike, we swim, we run, we, we do triathlons and we're with a group of people in the community that do healthy things like that and have fun times together. But, you know, in all the activity we do, we never really thought about coming down to the river, jumping in our kayaks and getting a workout here. And I think it's fantastic that people are out today and we need to do more of that, get together some groups and A plus to the Indestog and Land Trust for getting us out here, having us experience our own community in a variety of ways and enlightening us to the possibilities of what we have in our own backyard and all around us. So. Well, here we are, it's uh, about 20 past eight and uh, of the couple dozen paddlers we had out here at the first meeting of the Great Falls Paddling Society. A, a handful are left exploring some of the sluiceways around the canals here. Uh, we're next to the Continental Mill right now before we head back to New Auburn. Uh, and this river has long had its biases and its perceptions about water quality and its suitability for recreation. And I think this, uh, this event and the turnout we had is really starting to change that perception and, and perhaps we can just blow it, literally blow it out of the water, uh, getting more people out here. So.